All right, my name's Moonlands, and welcome back, everybody, to God of War. Here we are, just trundling around these little ice caverns. We're just going to pick up some some bonus material here because we've just unlocked at the very end of the last episode a little secret hatch here. So we're going to go inside and uh, just have a quick look here. What's through here? Some XP, apparently. And a glacial catalyst, a shard of one of Hell's glaciers. It can be used to upgrade the charm of infinite storm. What is that? What is the charm of infinite storm? Is that a particular enchantment or something? Possibly. Herizle. Isn't that the name of the dragon we fought? Or very close to it? I think feel like Herizle with a Y R or something at the end. And this one's just Herizla with an A on it. Maybe they're related. Don't know. Uh What a sad sorry sight you are. What are we doing now? So we're going up to the next area. I think we've just done that little boss battle there. Just beaten so to, to, well two brothers but one of them we managed to chop our axe to his face and the other scuttled off like a little bint to tell his daddy so we're left to try out this door here because that's the only place left to go everywhere else caved in and I'm trying to, trying to get the hang of how to open these things. There we go. Excellent. Hey, I just realized Magni didn't come back to life. That is interesting. It's known the Aesir find their own way to Valhalla. No Valkyrie escort, no processing at the gates of Helheim. That may be significant. Always look up. Always look up. So what do you do? Yeah, that fight with the two brothers was quite funny. Because we, we absolutely violated them, but we ended up making ourselves look kind of stupid because we weren't really dodging their attacks properly. Because we kept thinking that I was going to get this sweet, sweet stun. I wanted to see what happened when we stunned him, but didn't. wasn't wasn't to be. I uh, had to do the boss battle the, the way the game wanted it, which is a shame. But uh, perhaps, usually when you get to that part of the game, it's unlikely you would be as boss as we are. Because we've absolutely smashed loads of side quests. So that's why we have this incredible... Flaming armor. We're part of the blazing squad now. Is this the blazing set of blazing? <coughs> oh gosh. Uh, what's it called? The blazing set of ablazement. Blazing magma pauldrons. Yeah, decent. Blazing magma. Everything. So we can get our increased chance for that circle. Just before I move on, I want to try this. Every time it comes back, you know that's a good sign. You can keep using it to mess about. What happens if we chuck it in this ice up here? No. I mean, it, I doubt it was going to do anything. If it would have done anything, it would have done something there. Now, did he... What did we do with this, then? What was the point of this, Badger? A realm tear? Dust of the Realms. Thank you. 12 out of 18. We are well over halfway now of the Realm Tears being closed. Was there anything down there that I just missed? No. No. It's very cold. He just runs around with his bare skin. It's insane. Look, the the Frostbite. Head. That should be a big red flag to his, would bring the day's to his son. To and use that his nip-nops haven't frozen off. To the, Jarl's main kitchen. the rest were sorted and sold. There is an exit under the thumb. Find a way across.
Yeah, I'll be like, Dad, Dad, I know I'm pretty much wrapped up. My face, I, I mean, I'm severely ill, which is no surprise because given the temperatures here, it is no joke that the, the skimpy stuff I'm wearing relative to the fact that we're in amongst these windy ice caverns. Uh, you know, I'm not surprised I'm ill. But Dad, you're wandering about bald, half naked, nips firmly still attached to your chest. How? How is that possible? Are you a god? A semi-god? A demi-god? A hemi-semi-demi-god? Just tell me, mate. Just tell me. Because something's not adding up. That's why I'd be saying. If I was a trace, you've just killed a god and your nips are still on your chest. What? What's happening, mate? Tell me. Please tell me. I don't know why I'm doing this because I haven't actually assessed what's happening here yet. Just assuming that we need it over there because there's a thing that you can freeze it with. So I'm just preemptively doing that in the hopes that this works. What have we got? Can we climb up here? I know that needs to be kicked down, so I guess not. There's an opening. Always worth trying. There's a path to the exit on the other side. Oh, so we don't need it there. He needs to get on it, does he? Why would we need that? So he's going to get on it. He's going to go across. He's going to kick that thing down. And then I need to go across, so I need to freeze it. Then. I see. No, no, keep going. Keep going. Yeah, that's it. Now you hop on, little one. Uh, quick, 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 quick. Premium timing. I need to hook it there. So I'm going to climb up. Thank you. Go on then. Stop coughing and kick it down, you f Daddy needs help. Do you think maybe because he's wearing this flaming armor, that's what's keeping him warmer? Just a lucky coincidence that I managed to get the flaming armor before uh, we got back to all this icy business. Well, if he was not... Uh, a god. Um. Wee. Guess we don't need to go down there anymore. Thought that was writing up there for a minute. Peculiar little spot this. Feels like there's more I might be missing. Anyway. There's I wonder how many more of these things there are that we've we've because I know we've seen quite a few in the past. Oh, no, too early. Come on. Yeah. No, it was, it was nearly there. Nearly there, it's down here somewhere. Oh no, it's fading. The other one's fading. It's really hard to control this. It's kind of frustrating. Here we go. Just in time. Imagine the sound designers just sitting recording like um, firework flares to make that sound. It would have been quite a fun afternoon. What do you call them? What do you call the thingies where you, you light the stick and you just like whiz it around? And you can write your name in the in the in the black night. You can see the fire linger in the air. Sparklers. Just just sound designers just sat there recording sparklers for ages, getting some nice oh nice loops of sparklers. Don't need that health. Yeah, all right. I'm just checking. I know we've been here before. I'm just checking. Checking any other new nuggets haven't occurred. Oh, here we go. God of can't jump down. Everything we just did. Climbed around a dead giant. Wrote a giant falling hammer. Fought some bad gods. What do you think mother would say? Bet you have come a long way. Thanks. 
Yeah, yeah, that's what she'd say. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, definitely. Yeah, yeah. She wouldn't say, like, what on earth were you thinking, child? Over there. Let's just... I know, I know, but, but as soon as we're right here... Oh, it's a triple. Three. What is this? What what battle is about to ensue here? Hidden chambers. Oh, that looks like a boss fight. That looks very dark, Soulsy. Another one here. Ah, you know this one, don't you? It's Thamu, the giant stone mason. Boy. Right behind you. Go on then. The giant left behind trying to tell stories. Bloody bloody blue 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 blue. But where's the? Oh, that's it. That's it. That's. That's all we need to know. Okay. We're getting there. How many? We're eight out of eleven. We're doing quite well there. Almost got all of them. Should I have a quick look? Pop a quick look in here. Wonder what it is. Yeah, yeah, the greatest stone mason, one of the biggest giants of all. He argues with his son, Hrib. Thur strikes him and gets lost looking for him. Thor chisels Thammer in the head and crushes the whole town. Yeah, yeah, we saw that. Thammer was building a wall around Jotunheim to protect giants from the Aesir. Did it ever get finished? Um. Well, we'll find out, won't we? Because we're on our way there at some point. But we're on our way there now. This place. What? Feels like, like a prison. Oh. That would explain the hefty magical lock on the outside. But it's more than that. I have this feeling. Like something is waiting for us down here. You've a knack for ominous statements, lad. What kind of something? I'm not sure. Something powerful. Whatever you feel, boy. We will handle it. We have come this far. Yes? Yes, father. Where are we classed as being now? Sixty-five percent complete Midgard, looking pretty good. Health. I'm curious as to what this could be. Obviously, it's going to be a boss, but is it going to be a troll? Is it going to be something really difficult? Because I'd think that the game would be set up in such a way that knowing that you just got this thing to open these things, that people, a lot of people would try it. So it can't be that hard, right? So we should be able to... Because there's nothing more frustrating than not having to walk away from a challenge. Oh, gosh. Oh, no. It's going to be a, one of these flying idiots. Ah, oh, These guys really annoy me. This could be difficult. This could be Tress Annoyant. Imprisoned? She actually did it. A Valkyrie? But I thought they were just spirits. Take caution, lads. A Valkyrie in the flesh. I can't think of a more formidable opponent. She does not attack. Does she even know we're here? Hello? 21 of 51, nearly halfway. Excuse me. Oh! I think she knows we're here now. Oh no. Oh, oh, I tried to press the dodge thingy, but it didn't work. Oh, oh god. Oh, oh god. Oh god. Oh dear. Oh my gosh. Oh crap. 
Why, why am I not dodging these? Oh, okay. Right, right, right. So, this is going to take a bit of practice in learning what her attacks are. Because she's pretty full on when she goes at it. There's a good pause in between each one to stop it, though. And she might keep dropping health because she just drops them there. So that's fine. Uh, I guess that closes through there once we start. At least our runic stuff keeps recharging quicker. That definitely affects her, which is good. So she just did a hit there where we blocked it, but there was not enough time to dodge it. She she came in with her second attack. Can just get these out as soon as possible. Oh, I need to get those counters in. I'll tell you what would be good, switch my rune to a Tempest. Yeah, I need to just dodge that one altogether. Oh, see, I should have known to run out of the way that one. Oh. Need to get those dodges in right. Oh, no. Oh, no, see, I need to just jump out of the way of that one. Oh, no. No, I jumped out of the way. No. So I can parry it if I do it right at the la right time, but if I just do it as she does it, it doesn't work. Better parries in, which is good. No! That one's such a bitch to get out of the way of. When she starts that, I need to get much further away. Just in time. And that one. Yep, one after the other. And that's how we do that. Oh, didn't quite get that one right. Oops, ouchie, ouchie. Ouchie, run, 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 run. Get it, quickly. Alright, well, ping him then. Because we're doing quite well here. No, I, I had it up, mate. Hmm. I think we'll go with the giant's frenzy, you know. Because once she's stopped, we can usually get that in quite well, so I think we'll try that. And then for this one... Hmm. I don't think that's going to help us, because... Because I don't... I tell you what, let's just try it and let's see... What it does. Let's see how it affects her. Eh, it's alright, but it's not that great. Mm. Yeah, it's alright. No, it's hard to tell without looking back at the footage of me using the other ones. Yeah, actually, that's pretty effective. It keeps her there. Looks like I can get out of the way reasonably quick. Yeah. Keep her there, keep her there, Treyas. Keep her there. Ah. Nah, see, it's not that good. Come on, get up, brother. Giant's Frenzy, not as reliable. 18,000 to increase the damage. Right, well, we've got a lot more frost, so that's good. And we'll switch this one, what we're we going to switch it to.
89 seconds. Hmm. What else have we upgraded? Is it this one? R2, yeah. So that does that much damage. That does stun 68 seconds versus 41 seconds. Grimvaldi's Anvil. Should we do that? Should we do that? See how that turns out? Frost, a lot of frost. Don't really get stun on her, so let's do that. Yeah, that's great. Yeah, that's great. Yeah, got it that time. Yeah, getting better at the timing here. Wait, what am I doing? Do it. Do the special attack. There we go. Doesn't give me a lot of damage. It really doesn't. Do it. No, no. Didn't work. Did not work. Yes. This circle of doom is excellent. Oh, oh dear. Oh, we're in trouble. We're in trouble. No. Ah. Oh. Damn. We got much closer there. Go back to the Glaive Storm. I feel like that did more damage. At least one of these. Something that's got good damage that doesn't have such a long time where she can just come... And I'm on her. She can't just come straight back or he just can't come straight back. What are these things? Are they genderless, these Valkyries? Because I did have that originally. It's a moderate amount of frost damage, and it's a wide arc. So what I do want is something that's more like on her, on that, on the person I'm attacking, which is why that's good, but it's just taking too long. Just, it's the timing of it's too much of a faff. So I just need to make... Like, that is an absolute smasher. Maybe I'll just do that, because when she's... I reckon, uh, if I get the timing right, this could be devastating. If I get it right. Right, we'll try going in with the Leviathan's Wake instead of that other thing. Because it's just... We're, oops, sugar. We're not giving ourselves enough time to get out of the way after we've done an attack. We just bang, get it in there, get it done. That's it, and we roll straight out of the way of that one. Great that if we can keep doing that. Keep it coming. Oh, but be wary of that. That's it. Get ready to dodge those when they come. Bang, right in the chops. Right in the chops. Oops, need to get my axe back. Oops. <sighs> Nearly too late there. Get that. Get that. Excellent stuff. Oh, apparently I didn't do, do that one right. Crap. Danger. Oopsie. Get those dodges in straight away. And right in the face. Damn it, she just sort of blocked it with her wing. Yeah, 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 yeah. Easy stuff, easy stuff. Whoopsie. Need more 
It's almost got a special back. Great stuff, great stuff, great stuff. Keep it coming. Got a good one there. Just got my axe back in time. We can do a bit more of this. Oh, get ready for that, boy. Special. Yes. Oh, almost got that in vain there. Come on. Oh no, completely missed it. Oopsie. Christ. No, 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 no. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. <laughs> yes. And again with this, a bit more of this, a bit more of this. Yes. Come on, Leviathan's wake any second now. Yeah, now we'll do it. We'll do it now. Bang. Oh, wait, where's my axe? Whoopsie. <laughs> Easy once you know the steps, man. I'm not ready. Oh. Oopsie, oopsie. Get it, get it. Yes. Oh, wait, she still got me then. Oh, God. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Please. Please, not now. Not like this. Oh, what? Come on. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Yeah, I'd love to get some. Oh, boy. Good job she didn't go for it. Oh, we got a special. Yes, let's do it. Finish with the hammer. Go on. Oh, no. Come on. Oh, we're so there. We're so there. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. It was, it was the pressure, knowing that was so close. Oh, I even got so much health back and then I just started doing stupid shit, jumping out of the way. Oh, we're there, we're there. It's done, it's done. We've got our patterns down. It's all over. I think I might have accidentally uh, might have ruined that one a little bit there. Oh.
Oopsie. I'm not ready. Oopsie. Slightly wrong on that. She like turned to the side a little bit there. Ha! Stay down, stay down. Oh, apparently I didn't block that one very well. Whoopsie. Get this in, get this in. Ow, ow. See, that time I was too early. <laughs> oh, crap. crucified for being that wrong. Come on, let's finish it. Let's finish it. Nearly. Saw that. Yes. Oh. What? No. Stay down. Stay down. Sorted. You have freed me from my corrupted form. My pleasure. You have my eternal gratitude. But my sisters remain trapped as I was. Take my helm. Find them. Free them. The fate of the Valkyries rests on your shoulders. Okay. Do we get some sweet, sweet armor as a result as well? Because that'd be great. I love how it does that. Like it puts it in his back pocket. Like this huge helmet. I'll just slot that away. That's pretty important. That's putting it mildly, lad. What do you know of them? Yeah. A fair question, and yet not one easily answered. I know more than most, but much of their history is veiled in secrecy. My own experience with the Valkyries ends with my imprisonment. You are avoiding the question, Head. As I said, brother, it's complicated. I don't know why or how they become such wretched creatures. But perhaps if we can free more of them. You want us to find more of those things? The fate of the Valkyries, lad. A more worthy endeavor there is not. It will be dangerous. Well, that hasn't stopped you before, eh? <sighs> That's the spirit. I really liked that boss fight. That was really... It was a good one. Because I still think I, I should have been doing better to act out, act at the right time when the... Uh, in the right way when the different attacks came because it got to the point where I knew exactly what I needed to do and I just sort of fluffed up occasionally but I liked there was a nice variety of things you could do I should have thrown the axe at him more times when she went up for the jump that would have been it much a much better thing to do rather than keep waiting for the parries but it was quite fun getting the parries in because I've had this problem with getting parries in at the right time so now that I've had a solid bit of practice with that 
um, I'm glad that I'll be able to move forward with those skills, those improved parry skills, thanks to this battle, which was just like all about the parries. And uh, I definitely had some problems initially when she was going for those the the unavoidable attacks because I was waiting too long because I'm used the, I kept thinking it was going to be like the travelers where they go for it and then you have to dodge slightly like a one a quick dodge and then a full roll. Um, but I should have just done a double roll like just straight away as soon as she does that. You have started a legendary favor. Corrupted Valkyries are powerful creatures found in the depths of the hidden chambers of Odin and other realms. Defeating them is no easy task and requires powerful equipment. Find and defeat all corrupted Valkyries to uncover the truth and receive legendary rewards. Gunner's helmet, legendary. The helm of the Valkyrie Gunner. Some vestige of her spirit remains longing to join her sisters. What have we got? Don't need all this health. Don't take the bit. Come on. We. I don't think we got hit too much in the in the battle. Obviously, we did in the first few. That's Guardian Steel. Used to upgrade armor, pommels, talismans. Cool. So that's probably the best stuff. Is this as Guardian business? It's all going to be as Guardian kit, is it? I don't want the health. Ooh. Feathers of the Fallen Servant. Legendary enchantment slightly increases max sprinting speed. I wonder what bonuses we get with that. Yeah, more adds Guardian Steel. And we have this here. Which is fine. Give me the health. Sturdy sign of resilience. Okay, just an average. Okay. Go to Sorkles. Increases luck by seven and slightly increases the max sprinting speed. Now luck is our chance to get um, those special things um, like the what do you call this? What is this? So that gives us five runic and all increases all frost damage by 15% and this gives us seven luck and more speed. We'll just do it for a while we're moving about, I guess. Do it for now. Now we've got doubly increased speed. So let's go. It's too much gr <coughs> green stuff is annoying me. Um, Should we go through the realm gate? Or should we get back on the boat? No, 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 the quest said get back on the boat. Quest said get back on the boat. Let's go back to the quest. Let's do it like good boys. Right, back up we go. All right. Let's hop in our little boat. What and get right back to it. Feel to have a look at the boy. No, I feel better now. I just needed to catch my breath. Where do we go next? Well, now that we've got the giant's chisel, we need to learn the travel room to Yacht Knight, so we can carve it into that special gateway atop the peak and open realm travel to the land of the giants. You don't know it? Alas, no. But the serpent did mention that the giants had entrusted that secret to Tyr. Isn't Tyr dead? Aye, but his hidden boat is very much in reach. The doors beneath his temple, submerged in the lake for generations until our snake friend shifted his weight. There we shall find the fabled Black Loon of Jotunheim. We could also explore some more. We got that chisel now, and that vault isn't going anywhere. Seems a shame to waste the boat. We shall see, boy. So... Got these little side quests to do. Mimir, I know we're almost done with that story. Oh, yes! Stuart the Brave, who accepts his fate to perish in Ragnarok. You think we'll be there when that day comes? I've seen enough of war between the gods. You, little brother, we can say. Looks like we're right close to one. Let's have a look where they are. Yeah, back to the Lake of the Nine. Easy. So, there's this one. Where are we? Where are we? Here he is. Right there. That one over there, these are all spots we previously went to, to just check out. 
and so we'll be revisiting them, I guess. So what I'll do... 80% completion of the Forgotten Caverns. Is I'll just cut to there. Unless some interesting stories occur in between. I'll just... Just cut to when we land there, because... There'll probably be some more things to fight, or some things to pick up. Seeing as we're right here, I'll follow this one on. But I'll just include this in the story episode, because... You know, why not? That was... Pretty succinct. Succinct? Now, is there going to be more stuff here, or have we already battered the fellas that were guarding whatever this was? Because I know we fought somebody here. There's some new things going to appear now. These bones pulse with magic. It must be Golvi. Apparently not. Could we, could we just hold on to it? Maybe we'll find the rest of them. This spirit lies to you, boy. How would you know? I have known many spirits. They are all liars. This one is different. I know it. You know very little. That's true. Send the other one over here somewhere, so we'll just... Oh! There weren't nightmares over there before. Wait, can we can we chuck their things back at them? Wait, 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 Treas, just just hold on a second. I want to see if I can fire their uh, projectiles back at them. No. Oh, okay. Well, that's fine. Yeah. All right. All right. Now, give me your thingy. Give me your. Yes. Oh no. Or did they just land on us and they didn't really hurt much? I don't know. Make, make it so there's just one. Yeah, I guess we'd know if it hit us. No, okay. Don't get clever with me, son. Health burst. I think I'm getting better at this. Thank you. Trusting the spirit to keep its word is foolish, boy. But if there's even a chance, don't you want to see mom again? Of course I. Oh! She is gone, Atreus. You must accept this. I do, but to see her again, just one more time. Why do you believe him? You do not know him or who he was. All of this is sinister. He wants to see someone he loved again. I. I understand how that feels. So, I don't think there's anything sinister about it. Hope is blinding your instincts, boy. Yeah, because we had the uh, ancient fella that we... punched the teeth in of earlier. Nope, nothing, okay. Govee's bones. What will you say to her? To Govee? Your mother. What have you left unsaid? I... I guess... I just want to know if she's okay. She is dead, boy. I know that! I... <laughs> you don't understand. Neither do you. Wee. Kratos is just smashing him in the dialogue at the minute. Poor young naive child. He does not know of what he speaks. Oh, have we just gone past it? Oh, of course. Of course it's right at the top of this. Making us climb, making us exercise. We're just on a massive fight. Oh, we got further away from it now. No? Yes? Yeah. All of them. The final bone. Yeah. 
We might as well return them to the spirit. Bone. Maybe he will keep his word. I know she's not coming back, okay? I know. I just... Never mind. I just gotta return the bone. Why is that sound? Is that just this the sort of sound that the the wind and the sea makes when you're in a cave like that? Can't remember the last time I was in a cave. Desecration, typically. Pieces of scattered corpse make for a piss poor soul. No hope for Valhalla or Helheim when your arms on one beach and your heads on another. Why not ask the spirit? I'm sure he will be forthcoming with answers. Uh, let me guess. We're gonna fight a skeleton. Just gonna call it now. The other one behind me is still frozen. <laughs> Sometimes when you see Mimir's head swinging around in the mid amidst all this, it, it does crack me up. Oh no, I want to see what happens if we get one of these with it. Yes. I think you got him. That was good, right? It was alright. Better. Excuse me. Oi. How many times do you have to press circle for this game to wake up? We have collected the rest of your woman's corpse spirit. Show us this magic you have promised. Ah, oh, my sweet Gulvik. Whole again. Rise, dear Gulvik. Awaken, O oh powerful Gulvik! Oh, yeah, no, that sounds great. She honor our request. And reunite us? In death. In death. Okay, you are right. Oh, 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 mighty, mighty Gulvig. Oh, so strong. So strong, mighty Gulvig. Yes. Gulvig. Oh, how mighty. I missed her. That's alright. I'll sort that out. No problem. No problem there, mate. Oh dear Gulvig. Dear right. pathetic Gulvig. I told you so. I told you so. You are naive, foolish boy. This is true as well. But do not take your disappointment out on me, boy. Take it as a lesson. Yes, sir. Yes. And we need to change our skills again because the Le Leviathan's Wake is just not great for day to day. It's not a day to day sort of uh, light attack. We want something that spreads over a large area. Oh, what was this one again? Yeah, not bothered by that. I quite like the ones where it's like. Yeah, which, which one is it? Charge of the White Bear? Yeah, that's. Yeah. Eh. Well, I, I, it is cool, that one. But, uh... That's pretty decent. What's the one with... Fury of the Ice Troll? These are, like, the same. Except this one's... Got a slightly quicker cooldown. This one gets a little bit of stun. Was this again? Yeah. We've not really bothered with Charge of the White Bear. 
Doesn't seem to be that fantastic. Good for stunnage, but we get a decent amount of stun doing our, like, shield uh, smash. How are these not the same thing? So you got this one here. Wait, which one's this one again? Oh yeah. So we got this radial shockwave, and we got this wide arching attack. I say we go this because for an extra seven seconds we get stun damage as well. And then, was this one again? Yeah, that's pretty good. Pretty good to stick with. Um, can't change it because we've got cooldown on it. Alright. Back to the story. Because we got a bunch of XP for that, didn't we? We must have done. Yeah, 15,000. And we have completed... Well, we completed that quest, so we got 1,880 for that. Tears Waste Armor Recipe. Tears Offering. Where's the rest of the un unfinished business? Spirits Freed, so that's... And I think we just finished that, didn't we? Yeah, we just finished unfinished business, because we've done... Oh, no, wait, that was a different quest. But I'm sure there was a thing where it was like, there's... M it, there's a bunch of those spirit-based things, and we've now done the, all those, so we got some extra XP for that. We got a little achievement, you know, a little trophy. Was it a silver trophy I think we got? Because we've faffed about with all the spirits of Midgard now. And now we're off to... Over here okay. somewhere. I know I saw something. I saw two. Rhea did say the Jotunheim realm tower was missing from the lake. But maybe only kinda? Very strange indeed. Yeah, I definitely... We all saw that. We all saw that, didn't we, guys? Oh! Oh, you know what's gonna really annoy me? In the cutscene, when I was talking to that spirit, there was a barrel that hadn't smashed. I'm going to go back and smash that barrel, just because it's going to annoy me now that I know it's there and I haven't smashed it. Okay, be right back. Here we are, look. In one. In one. Alright, back we go. I also noticed that there was a a golden chest, which usually has uh, runic attacks or something like that in it, or, or armor or whatever, that I, didn't cr uh, that I haven't opened. That's right outside this corner, so I'm going to See if I can open that, because I think I meant to go and do it, and then I forgot. Because it's it looks like it needs breaking uh, with a, a fiery pot. So it's just around this corner here. See that gold gloopy stuff? Up there. Right there on the other side. I don't know if we can... Don't know if we can actually get in there yet. So it's... So it's I think from this angle, from being up here, we should be able to hit the pot and then open it up. I feel like we've been up here, but then I must have forgotten. Aha! We have some balls! So now we can get that chest. Um, but unfortunately, God of War is the, also the god of not being able to jump down off anything. So we're going to go all the way round. Yay! No, nope, can't jump off there. No, 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 it's too high. It's too high. He might injure himself. He might injure... Oh, but wait a moment. Didn't he jump off a ginormic hammer that was smashing its way down a mountainside with ice and all kinds of other highly dangerous and damaging things? And he threw himself all over that and came out fine. And yet he can't take a step off a curb. 
Noms and us. Great stuff. That's what we need to unlock the realm of mist. Just slowly, carefully descend here. Because it's all good practice and not time consuming for no good reason at all. If there isn't a boss where which involves climbing grip strength. I'm going to be even more annoyed. Hmm. Curious. I bet it's worth going up there again. Through that spot there. Anyway, back to its jury. Get it open. I love that sound. Oh. Thought they'd gone away and I'd have to get all three of them again. Setting foot in Tears Vault. Another one of these. It's Tear, but the middle panel is missing. Wait, I thought Tear was a god, not a giant. Ah, but he was loved by everyone, including the giants. Other than me, he was the only one they gifted with their special sight. Hey, I wonder if the giants left a triptych about me somewhere, too. Well, we'll Go see, ahead. won't we, Mimi? Actually, come look. Let me show you how to read this. That is not necessary. You've taught me so much. Let me teach you something. So this just does these all just take us back outside, yeah? Yeah. Okay. Go on then, teach me, boy. What if you need to use one and I'm not there? This will be fun. Fun. Andreas. Come on. You already speak it. Learning to read won't be that hard. I know how to read, boy. Just not this tongue. You're halfway there already, then. Okay. So the runes represent a lot of different things. Some gods. Some animals. Wait. Some... Oh, am I going too fast? Sorry, Not I'll... that. Do you smell something? Yeah, I do. It smells like... Rain? Hello. You ruined everything. I earned that fucking hammer. But now, everyone's gonna think I only got it. Cause Magni's gone. It'll be a joke. But if I kill you, no one's gonna laugh at me. You're not gonna kill me though, that's the thing. Dumb. That your father's doing? Or did you get it from your mum? She's stupid and ugly. Shut up! <laughs> Kratos, get up, man. I don't know anything about my mother. Oh, it's true. But I'm gonna get to know you really well. You're gonna be my new brother. Right after I finish killing your father! Oh. Oh, nice. Atreus Rage. Whoops. I think I broke him. <laughs> this is how you do it. No. Stay back. Oh. 
Come on, batter him. Let me play. I want to smash his head in. Oh, I hate this guy. He's so annoying. Brother, the boy. Atreus. You have to get into Freya quickly. There's no other way. Oh, I want to smash his head in. But quickly, quickly. What is it with him? When it comes to carrying stuff, he takes like half an hour to get two feet. Smashy, smashy. Oh, it's all done in three seconds. Carefully carry something. Pop it in a, in a convenient position. Construction. Oh, no, 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 no. He's like a flipping cowboy contractor. It takes seven years to do it and never complete the job. Smashy, smashy. Yeah, bang up. Five seconds, mate. Top job. Why has everything gone black? Is this just... Is this how Kratos is seeing everything right now, or...? Odin's eye is on you, brother. Especially now that you've taken to killing his kin. Freya's forest is a blind spot for him. This is our smartest move. And if anyone can heal him, it's hard. What is happening to him? I've seen it in mortals that some conflict of the mind expresses itself as an ailment of the body. Never in a god. And a god believing himself mortal. I can only imagine. We're almost there. Be good because, like, they could. It's too early in this game. But we could have a way for Kratos to be killed off officially now that we have Kratos, Atreus to take over. God, he's good at this slow walk, isn't he? Somebody just called the serpent. Look at this solid camera work from me. The slow bad boys pan. Pacing. He's getting stressy. He's like, come on. And then he's going to proceed to walk at 0.001 miles an hour to get there. Yeah, 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 yeah. Pace up and down on the uh, lift because you're stressing out because it's taking too long. But then, but then just inch forward, mate. The fever burns harder. He is shaking. It's serious. We must hurry. Yeah, hurry. Just, uh, just hurry. Just, just hurry. Hurry up, guys, because he's... No, that's it. Yeah, just catch your breath, mate. I know he's, I know he's heavy, but just hurry. Quick, because we're almost there. Freya! Open the door! We need your help! Woman, do you hear me? It okay. is urgent! How polite he's not I'm just breaking down the door. Go away! The boy has fallen ill! Freya! He's ill. Never heard him sound so upset. Inside. This is no ordinary illness. The boy's true nature, your true nature, fights within him. I did this to him. Will you help me? Of course. There is a rare ingredient found only in Helheim. The keeper that protects the Bridge of the Damned. I need its heart. 
hell. The realm of the dead. Do you know it? Not this one. It is a land of He's been to hell twice. Fires can in Greece. There, and no magic in all the nine realms can create a blaze. As for the dead, your frost axe will be useless. You'll need to find something else. Then I must return home. What's it gonna be? Dig up a past I swore would stay buried. Who you were before doesn't matter. This boy is not your past, he is your son. And he needs his father. This rune opens the bridge to Helheim. When you are there, do not under any circumstances cross the Bridge of the Damned. There is no road back. Understand? Boy. Himmel. Hey, you must hurry. Through my garden, there's a path leading to my boat. Take it. Return home. Dig up your past. Do whatever you need to do. Just bring me back the Bridge Keeper's heart. And your son may survive. Now. That sounds like a bit of an equilibrium... Uh, disturbing thing to bring back the bridge to hell keeper's heart no you were right to distrust the word of a god no need to explain not to me not for that I will keep him safe that's a mother's promise <laughs> you can still smash stuff up in here. This is what I love. All this drama going on. Can we smash the wood? I bet we can smash the wood. Go on. Can we get up here? Can we get up here and smash the wood? Ah, oh, so funny. Just all like peaceful and dramatic. My boat is down the path. Use the garden door. Foosh! <laughs> Alright, can we run now? Helheim of all places. You all right, brother? I will do what I must. Leave me be. Oh, look how pretty her little boat is. So, uh... Are we going to be getting the, um, the what's the chomps? The blades, the double, the double blades on the chain. From the, uh, from the originals. Oh, look at another one of those deer. Oh dear. Odin's having a fit. Because he doesn't, because he, he did all the business in the first three and whatever side games there were. Smashing up all the gods and totally taking Olympus to task. Including killing his own father. Like all the stuff we've been told is terrible in the first one. Who the, who's that? Is that Mama Kratos? Athena. And he doesn't want to go back and pick up all that because that's what he decided to leave behind and try and live a quiet life and not be smashing up gods Get all day long. My head. And that went horribly wrong. And that's just going to go even more wrong because he's off to get his Olympus smashers back. So used to the axe now. It's gonna be weird getting those. Or maybe it's maybe a sword of some sort. Either way, it'd be interesting to see how it changes the combat or what it adds to the combat. And will we get to keep the axe or do we change from the axe to these permanently? Whatever this new weapon is. Oh, look! Fella up there. 
waiting to get violated. Sorry if I'm destroying the atmosphere of this. It's very, uh, very moody. I like it a lot. Just thinking out loud, you know? More enemies. This is where we started the game coming in on the boat, isn't it? We carried the big log up here. Oh! Oh, it's so weird. My first reaction was to throw, go and throw the... Uh, How did you block that? How are you blocking that so fast? Ah, oh, okay, so this already started where the axe does nothing. Except it does when we do our rooms, apparently. Yeah, okay, that still works. So we'll s when they've got their guard down. So I'll tell you what, let's just stick to our fisticuffs then. See, right approach for the right enemy, and you're all sorted. What? Oh. Who were? That theme. But now it's like. Put as much distance between you and the truth as you want. It changes nothing. Pretend to be everything you are not. Teacher. Husband. Father. But there is one unavoidable truth you will never escape. You cannot change. 
You will always be a monster. I know. But I am your monster no longer. Amazing. Amazing. Right, let's see what those blades can do. Yes, let us. Wait. Oh, 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 oh dear. Oh no. So do they have do we have special like attacks on these as well? If I hold R2. No. These are more just like whip it about. What about if I sprint? No. We've got two empty room thingamabobs though. That's pretty cool. Looks like it's just swing and hit at the moment. I can't seem to get any fancy stuff to turn up. So if I do this change stance stuff? No. Basically just keep swinging him and he keeps going. Oh, this is so clap. This is just like... Exactly like the originals. Just whip and whip and go. Just keep it rolling. And I love that you can get some much better distance from them as well. You just keep swinging and you're basically invulnerable. I don't need to anymore. Mixing up. Yes, those blades will serve quite well in your life. You know, I believe I see a door to the realm between realms over there, in your own front yard, no less. Take the shortcut back to the realm travel temple, then on to Helheim, yeah? Yep. Cheers, mate. Can we get back through here? I was trying to see if just like hitting R1, R2, like varying it would. So that's what he does. You keep going. Yeah, and then if you do R2, you get that. Right, so if you go R1, R1 maybe. Right. So it's pretty much just smash the hell out of everything. Ooh. Great stuff. Right, back to Brock's shop then. Oh, we're such an absolute monster, in Athena's words. Well, I'm pretty sure you weren't talking to me back there. How do you switch? Anything you'd like to get off your chest, brother? Ah, uh -huh. so you switch left and right. Well, Sorry, Mimi. You know where to find me. And for the record, I'd already guessed you were Greek. Athena, dead giveaway. Come on. There we go. Okay. We got our buttons sorted. <laughs> the sickness. What? Hey! You reek of foreign magic! Sweet Nana's nethers. What are those? 
I've never seen the like. That's gotta be a family heirloom. No. Nor will it ever be. Son. My brother and me created Mjolnir for the big idiot. I know from quality. And them... Them special. <laughs> Look at his greedy little dwarf eyes. Where's the little turd? He has fallen ill. You know it has to be good when no. Brock's shitting himself for him. What happened? Aesir? No. The fault is mine. And my responsibility to make it right. Well... We all gotta take responsibility sometime. Huh? Say, what can I do to help him? I can do things. And what I should tag along? No. Your work here... is enough. Alright. So where are you off to in such a hurry? The realm of the dead. Helheim? Shit, this is serious. <laughs> Don't worry. I'll be keeping my eye on you. One more frozen flame to get it up there. Blades of Chaos! A Chaos Flame. Do we not have a Chaos Flame yet? Doesn't improve much, does it? I thought we already had a Chaos Flame. Picked up at some point. Then again, where would we get one from? I know we've got some sort of flames. It was a crest of the something. Flame. Um. Yeah, we need crest of the flame. That's what we've got. Of course, we've got loads of those, so it can't be. They'd be way more rare if that's what if that's really what we uh, we're after. Can we craft anything? Blades, pommel. Uh oh. When did we collect those? Do we get sockets? Do we get sockets on them? It's a legendary grip. We can get more smoldering embers, right? Let's do it. Moderate perk activation chance of any successful hit to ground or of fire increasing strength and restoring a small amount of health. It's done, baby. Equip. Oh, yes. We're such a monster now. It's silly. It's silly. See, this armor of the travelers so easy to craft as well. Yeah, that's just... That's not even slightly... Uh, costly to us. Just just not worth cra crafting because it's just not as good. A lot of vitality. Yeah, it's just, just a, uh, basically a defense armor, isn't it? Still not got as much defense as some of our other things anyway. Just on, on level with our defense. Only one enchantment socket as well. What's new in the waste armor? Yeah, it's cute. We don't need it. Oh, we can upgrade that. Don't need that. Pretty good on the runic, but we don't need it. Yeah, can't get that. Can't get that. Oh, do we have any lost items? No. No need. I'm just going to quickly get all these exclamation marks out of the way because it's going to annoy me. Wrist armor. Doesn't do much. Not as good as this. You only get one enchantment sockets as opposed to the two. For something with one. Oh, it's got zero and we can move it up to one. It's pretty good. If you put some of the stuff in the enchantment socket, that is actually really good. The plated. Room Weaver Braces, if we put something good in it. Holy hell, we're level 5 now. When did that happen? Was that when we upgraded the Blades of Chaos? Why can't we craft anything for the... How can we unequip that? So we're level 5 now. 
We've been we were level one for the longest time. We were level three for ages, and now we've just smashed through level three at the end of it. We went through halfway level three, and now we're on a third of the way through level five. Me too. Or maybe a quarter, if it fills up relative to the size of the five square. If it's purely how high up it is, then we're a third. Um, we can buy a tax. Oh my. Max damage, Crest of the Flame. Oh, we need a lot of stuff to get that. I had no idea you could buy attacks. We could buy a Frozen Flame by getting the Chilling Mist of Niflheim. Oh, okay. That's weird. Just a swap, essentially, there. Let's sell some stuff. No. Have we not got any green crap we can sell? I suppose we could sell the blue stuff. Definitely sell the green stuff. I don't know why, I just... I feel like m maybe there's some that are just sleepers that are really good to upgrade. And once you've upgraded them a massive amount, then they become really good. But... I don't know, it looks like we're pretty, pretty much all set at this point with some ridiculously good crap. All the rest of it was blue. Yeah. See, like these... Some of these level 4s have... Like some of this lot might be worth upgrading, perhaps. But I don't know. Don't need that. This is all buying our own crap back. Oh, we can buy some of this. Smoldering embers. Stat bonus along with greatly increased duration of the wrath of the Frost Ancients runic attack. Blessing of the Frost Ancient. So these are all like runic attack, but boosters. A lot of those require smouldering embers, which is interesting given that they're ice attack boosters. Could buy these, easy. Cooldown, runic, look. Yeah. I don't think we've got much need for that, have we? Definitely don't need any of that green crap. Let's get a magical stone that revives creators from death with full rage. And a small amount of health. Press square when Kratos dies to allow Atreus to resurrect him and rejoin the fight. Only one resurrection stone can be carried at a time. Small amount of health. Large amount of health. Large, full rage and small amount of health. I mean, we've got 492,000. Let's just get the Berserker stone. About time we got ourselves a stone back. I can't believe we've forgotten to do that for so long. World Serpent Scales. We don't need to get any of this. Because we, we pick it up. Um, yeah, I think we're all good, mate. I think we're all good, Brock. Oh, yes. Wait, hold on, hold on. Mm-mm-mm-mm-mm. Oh, none. Oh, none. Oh, yeah, yeah. We'll, we'll, we'll definitely uh, go with the wooden blade grips, won't we? Fool. Grips of the Forgotten Flame. Absolutely. Can't wait to get some skills on these bad boys. What do we got? What do we got? We've got 37,000 points, so let's get some stuff upgraded. While sprinting, press R1 to execute a powerful double dash slash attack. Yep. And this is the R2 version, is it? Over here. Press R2 to form a power attack that launches enemies into the air. Hold R2. R2 is the opposite of the axe where we swing down. So we get that. The axe is only on level 1, so we can't get any of this. While aiming, press R1 to impale an enemy and yank them towards Kratos. That looks good. Yeah. Wait, that's already unlocked. Okay. Perform. That has no additional bonuses. Too bad. Perform attacks in quick succession without sustaining damage to power up the blaze of chaos and inflict burn damage on every hit. Bonus to luck and runic. Ooh. Once we've hit this one, do we we unlock at level two? Press and aim and press R2 to perform a powerful sweeping attack that inflicts heavy burn damage. Yes. Yes, please.
excellent stuff. What level? We're on level five. How do we get to level two again? Hope that's not goblin of yours is on the men, sir. We need a chaos flame. So we can't get anything else till we get the chaos flame. Okay. Yeah, those blades of chaos. Look at them. Look at them. Ridiculous. Okay. What are we off to now? I guess we'll close out the episode here. Because, uh... Now that Freya's given you the travel room to Helheim, it should be unlocked on the table. Great, so what we'll do is... We will leave this session of brutality here. I will, uh... Tell you to smash the like button if you liked it. Hit subscribe so you don't miss any of my. Uh, well, you hit that. You subscribe and you hit the bell so you don't miss any of my future content. Subscription definitely more important to me because it just shows me that I've got some support, more regular viewers. You know, um, helps my channel grow because if I don't get a thousand subscribers or whatever the bar keeps raising to now, I won't be able to monetize any of this content. So please do subscribe, it really makes a massive difference. Um, and uh, yeah, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.